Okay, what makes an iconic third shot drop? There are three things that you can do to improve your game right now. You know, right now, this evening. <laughs> the first thing you can do to improve your third shot drop is to think vertically. I prefer six feet high. And if you look at Ben Johnson, he's in the top right hand corner. He's thinking vertically. He's not thinking horizontally like most people do. He's really lofting that return into the sky. The sky, vertically. And this will make you a lot more consistent, trust me. Second thing you can do to be more consistent on your third shot drop is not to have a wiggly wrist. That took me like three times to say, wiggly wrist. Now let me elaborate. If you look at Kyle Yates, he's in the near left hand corner. It's a full motion. It's with his full forearm. He's, if you look at his right leg, he's really, really getting balanced with it. And it's a full motion. That full motion, like in tennis, badminton, any other sport, it's going to build consistency. And that will help you be a lot more effective. The final thing that will help you is have relaxed hands. Have confidence where it is going. Don't try to place it. And that's the main point I can make. Don't try to place it. When you do, that's when you kind of push the ball. It sits up and the other team will have a put away on that fourth shot. So have relaxed hands. And like Bill Murray said in Caddyshack, you know, let the ball go where it's supposed to be. <laughs> let me summarize. Loft your returns for a more consistent third shot drop. If you looked at Ben Johns in the first example, he lost his return. Second, have a simple motion, no wiggly wrist. Have a smooth, consistent, full motion, just like Kyle Yates. <laughs> the third thing you can do, we saw David now do it, have relaxed hands. Don't try to place the ball. Let the ball go where it's supposed to be. You know, and everything's going to be okay. Guys and ladies, I truly enjoyed doing this. Please subscribe. Have, have an awesome Saturday evening. Hopefully you're doing more than me tonight. Have a good night. <laughs>